Hello, how are you? Uh, this is uh, Barista Bernardo Antonio. So uh, today, I want to share with you how to calibrate the Cineso MVP on how we can able to do a very nice coffee with for espresso. So first and foremost, before we start, I'll show you how to do uh, the control panels. So uh, first of all, before we do our calibration from our Cineso uh, MVP Hydra, uh, we need to check our our computer over here it's called a control panel we need to check our temperatures if the temperatures are right and also the, the steaming uh, the steaming ones actually if the pressure also are good so i'll be able to scroll over here uh, my temperature for my group head group head one is 94 degrees celsius and for my group head two is 94 degrees celsius but i'll just do an overview uh, on the things that we have or the parameters that we have in our control panels so if I press my first button, you'll see the auto back, uh, auto back flash uh, setting board. If I scroll down a little bit again, we'll able to see uh, the ramp up, which is 96. You'll see the total water count. You'll see it is 973. So if you want to adjust it, you can able to click the first button. Uh, it's blinking 96. If you want to increase it, you can increase it by this one. It's weight 97. If you want to decrease it, 96. Mine is 96. Uh, the pre-infusions, uh, the ramp up, uh, it will give you. So if I want to change my pre-infusion uh, for the group 2, just click over here. If I want to do the pre-infusion, I just click over here. So this is actually uh, a control panel uh, to set your group head. So uh, we are going to do our, our calibration. Uh, so I'll take my, my, my porta filter uh, over here. Make sure it is uh, clean. Uh, I'll backflash my, my water. Uh, from here then i'll put my water filter uh, on the scale then i'll try it to make it a zero then i'll be able to pull a shot i'm using a, a brazilian coffee so i already calibrated my uh, my dose which is 19.6 so i'll pull it over here uh, so do uh, the dose this one is a 19.6 and again also on my coffee here the dose also is 19.6 then you can able to see this the dose so i'll check it then uh, i will uh, level it nicely just make a pinch of ball then i'm leveling after leveling i'll uh, put it over here then we need now to turn so i'll make sure that uh, do uh, a soft turn that one, then that one there. It's supposed to be like a football pitch, an actual round. Then what you need to do, uh, I confirm my load is 9.6. Then I'll take the small scale, which is this one, and over here. Set it. So so you make sure that it's like this one, zero zero. So I'm using this part for calibration. So what you need to do next, this is VP, this is VP. So we need to turn it into a, a calibration format. So I'll make sure I'll do all the groupets uh, to M. Then press the left, on the left side. It has come to M, it has come to M. Then now I'll take my dose, uh, which is this one, this is my dose. So this is a crucial part. You're supposed to focus actually on this one. Then I'll take my cup, uh, put it beneath here. Then I will tear my cup. Then I will start the the coffee. So my uh, my ram up will be five seconds. After five seconds, I'll do a ram down until uh, twelve seconds, uh, like that one. Then when the coffee starts dropping from here, this is not a good sign. I'll press this one. So the coffee has started dripping. So you can see the flow is not that too fast. The slow, the flow actually is a slow flow. So these are my total manual brews, and the time here actually is the brew after the espresso has dropped. So since it is 19.6 uh, grams, I'm targeting 40 ml. So once it is 40 ml, I'll stop uh, over here. So you can see my ml is 38. 
and it has given me a total draw of 41. Then it has given me uh, 26 seconds. So this is actually my brew ratio. So if I want to save, what I'll do, I will uh, adjust my group heads into the left, like this one, where I'm doing. Then it will come into a saving mode. The yellow ones that look like a memory, and like a saving mode. Then this arrow shows you now you need to save. So I will click my group heads. If I click one, I'll be saving one, but I'll click two to save the simultaneous group. So I'll click this one. Simultaneously it will blink, click thrice, this is the second it will blink, and the third time it will blink. Then to save it actually into an uh, automatic mode, I will press on the right, on both group heads, until it comes to VP, this is manual, but I want into VP, so I press again like this one, into VP. So now it has stayed. Cut. Yes, so that's all from uh, Barista Antonio. So we have just done the uh, how to do the calibration of the MVP uh, Hydra Sineso and uh, this is my shot. So hope to see you uh, in the next video. Uh, shukran. Cut.